I fundamentally believe that there is a chance of, of supporting a healthy 10 billion people on a, on a healthy planet. But that will require a lot of changes. My name is Lauri Reuter. I'm a Singularity U faculty on the future of food. I'm a, I'm a recovering scientist. I used to, used to do research in biotech and then food tech. But since I've moved to, uh, to venture capital to find the most interesting and the most bold and outrageous new technology companies that will shape the future food system. Uh, the biggest challenges for the uh, food system in the future are first of all our own health, which is in horrible shape, but also the environment and the uh, sufficiency of resources that we have on this planet. Some of the most interesting things happening right now is, is replacing the animal-based products in, in the food system and, and we have completely new capabilities of doing that from growing meat from cells or replacing, replacing animal-based things with plant-based things. That's quite obvious and that's happening already now. Another thing that is, is going on is, is digitalization of how we make decisions on food. So right now we're still going to a grocery store and, and we picking things from the shelves based on our ideas what's good. But soon enough we can start using massive amounts of data in a smart way and, and help in that decision making. And that will fundamentally change in how we, how we interact with the food system as consumers. I hope that all these number of changes happening at the same time will in the end enable us to live healthily first of all on, on a green planet where there's still a lot of uh, diverse life around us and climate that is suitable for living. After all, in the long run, the only sustainable business around food is something that is sustainable for the environment and for our health. And that's important to realize right now. The technologies to enable these kind of changes are increasingly there. I think the biggest obstacle is, is, is us humans, how bold we can think. What excites me the most is, is to see that look in people's eyes when they realize something completely new about their everyday life and the possible futures. So I think it's very important that Singularity U uh, Portugal is bringing all these people together and all these ideas together and also um, kind of shake up that thinking and help us to imagine the possible futures and the possible use of all these technologies that we have at hand. Otherwise, nothing will happen. I think that's a good reason to come and be part of this community.